Google just released a new update for its AI chatbot, Bard, and this changes everything. When Google initially released Bard, it flopped almost immediately because the chatbot could not even perform basic tasks properly. So Google had to go back to the drawing board to figure out a way to make Bard a worthy rival to ChatGPT. And now, the tech giant has finally upgraded Bard, making it more powerful than even OpenAI's GPT-4 language model. Today, we are going to talk about Bard's new features and how the chatbot will transform the AI landscape. But before we begin, hello and welcome to the AI Trend, your go-to destination for all things AI. We are dedicated to bringing you the latest developments, breakthroughs, and releases in artificial intelligence technology. So subscribe to stay updated on how AI is reshaping our world. Without further delay, let's get started. BARD is an AI model created by Google that lets users collaborate with generative AI. It was launched back in early 2023 to boost productivity, help generate ideas, and satisfy the curiosity of users. BARD was designed to be used for a wide range of purposes, including answering questions, generating articles, brainstorming ideas, and so much more. It was initially powered by Google's language model for dialogue applications, or Lambda. Lambda is Google's flagship AI model that can generate natural and coherent conversations on any topic. Unlike ChatGPT, BARD was not released to the public immediately after its launch. Due to safety concerns, Google released BARD to only a few trusted users, but it has since expanded to over 180 countries around the world. BARD underperformed when it was launched because it was powered by a lightweight version of Lambda, which was not really good enough and could not perform basic math or solve complex problems. To fix that problem, Google decided to use its more advanced AI model, Palm, to power BARD. This new model equips BARD with enhanced logical reasoning skills and the ability to handle math and coding problems. In simple terms, BARD can now solve problems that involve calculations, formulas, and even coding. You can ask BARD to do things like calculate the area of a circle or write a simple Python function for you. And the best part is that BARD won't jump straight to the answer. It will show you the steps it took to get there. To be honest, this new feature of BARD is incredibly impressive. It takes the chatbot to a whole new level in terms of learning, teaching, and creating. Just imagine how useful it can be to students who need help with their homework, teachers who want to create engaging lessons, or developers who want to prototype new ideas. Essentially, BARD can be your personal tutor, assistant, or collaborator. I know that you're probably thinking, how does BARD know how to solve all these problems? Well, that's where Palm 2 comes in. Palm 2 is an advanced language model that combines the best of both worlds. Traditional learning models are really good at predicting text based on probabilities and patterns learned from large amounts of data, making them great at generating coherent sentences. However, they often struggle with logical reasoning and math-related questions. On the other hand, code-based computation models are fantastic at executing code and performing accurate calculations but they're not so great at generating natural language. They often give robotic and hard-to-understand responses. Palm 2 solves this problem by integrating both types of models into a unified framework. It uses a special architecture that can process both natural language and code tokens simultaneously, making it a powerhouse when it comes to solving problems. The model uses something called a dual attention mechanism which allows it to focus on both text-based and computational information separately or together. This means Palm 2 can generate responses that are informative and conversational at the same time. One of the best things about Palm 2 is its ability to perform implicit code execution. Basically, it can figure out when a question requires computation or code generation without explicitly being told so. Another amazing feature of Palm 2 is its ability to respond to questions in a table format and export the results to Google Sheets. But how does Bard's new update compare to other chatbots like ChatGPT? Well, you might not believe this, but Bard is much more intelligent and powerful. While ChatGPT 3.5 struggles with basic math, let alone coding or complex math problems, 
the new version based on GPT-4 has made some improvements in aligning with BARD's abilities in math and coding. But even with that, I'd argue that BARD still has a slight edge over GPT-4 when it comes to mathematical reasoning. Google has reported that BARD's accuracy for computation and math problems has improved by up to 30% in their internal datasets. They've even shared some examples of BARD's impressive responses to these questions on their website and blog. This just goes to show the potential BARD has. BARD's new features give the chatbot incredible potential in various industries and domains. In customer service, for example, BARD can provide personalized and efficient support, reducing the need for human intervention in routine queries. In education, it can offer interactive and adaptive learning experiences tailored to the individual needs of students. And in creative fields like content generation, BARD can be of great help to writers marketers, and content creators, assisting with idea generation, editing, and creating diverse content formats. The possibilities are endless. But wait, there's more to BARD than just professional applications. Chatbots like BARD can also provide companionship and support for individuals who need emotional or mental health assistance. By using natural language understanding and empathetic responses, BARD can lend a listening ear and offer resources to those seeking support. Of course, it's important to strike a balance between the benefits and potential risks. AI companions like BARD should never replace human interaction but rather complement it. We must address the issue of bias in AI systems as well. Since BARD and other language models are trained on massive amounts of data, they can inadvertently exhibit biased behavior if the training data contains biases. Google is aware of this concern and has implemented techniques to detect and reduce bias. However, continuous monitoring and improvement are crucial to ensure fairness and inclusivity. Privacy is another key aspect to consider. As BARD interacts with users and collects data, effective data protection measures should be in place to safeguard user information and comply with privacy regulations. Google also needs to be transparent about its data collection and usage practices, empowering users to make informed decisions about sharing their personal information. There's also the concern of potential misuse and malicious intent. Chatbots can be used to spread misinformation engage in harmful activities, or deceive users. To prevent this, Google needs to have strong content filtering mechanisms in place to block inappropriate or harmful responses. Regular audits and updates are essential to tackle emerging challenges and ensure user safety. Also, the rise of advanced chatbots raises questions about the impact on employment. As these AI systems become more capable, there may be concerns about job displacement in industries that heavily rely on human interaction, such as customer service. These are important considerations that need to be addressed moving forward. When it comes to releasing chatbots like BARD, it is crucial to focus on enhancing human capabilities rather than replacing them. This approach creates new opportunities for collaboration between humans and AI, opening doors for teamwork and shared expertise. To ensure responsible AI usage, Google needs to provide developers and organizations with clear guidelines and best practices for implementing BARD. By promoting responsible development and usage, we can harness the technology for the greater good and ensure its positive impact on society. The introduction of POM2 into BARD brings exciting possibilities for the future of human-computer interaction. With its advanced capabilities in understanding context, generating human-like responses, and integrating various forms of input, BARD could revolutionize how we interact with AI systems. As the technology continues to evolve, we may witness the emergence of chatbots that seamlessly integrate with virtual and augmented reality environments, enabling users to engage in realistic and immersive conversations with AI avatars. Moreover, the advancements in chatbot technology, including BARD, can greatly benefit individuals with disabilities or those facing communication barriers. For people with speech impairments, hearing loss, or other disabilities, AI-powered chatbots can serve as vital communication aids. These chatbots provide a means for individuals to express themselves effectively and engage in conversations more effortlessly empowering them to communicate and connect with others. 
I've always known that Google has the potential to dominate the AI race, and this latest update to Bard only proves it. The tech giant plans to beat OpenAI's ChatGPT using Bard, and it seems to be heading on the right trajectory. But do you think Bard can beat ChatGPT? Let us know in the comments. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to stay updated about the latest developments in the world of AI.